We're at Yaz Island in Abu Dhabi for the Formula One Grand Prix. That's all you need to know. We are uh, we are down to the wire, and I mean down to the wire. Um, Got to make up seven points on Verstappen to win the uh, the championship. We've already locked. I mean, if we even get three or four points um, tomorrow, I think uh, we basically have the constructors locked up. They need. Hello and thank. I think uh, we have 61, they have 17, 41, 44, they need 44 points. Um, Verstappen is crucially, crucially taking a grid penalty. I don't, obviously I try not to lean too much into practice, it seems it's all a bit fluky. Um, pretty high confidence, pretty high confidence, I don't really want to touch much. Um, we'll go this way, just a little bit of camber. Hopefully, I was going to say, thankfully, by the end of the season, we've actually figured out how to make our car go fast. Um, you know, I'm not even going to mess with it too much. I'm going to revert it. I'm going to revert it. I think I might make a small wing change. Just pop. One, one click up on the front wing. And uh, with Lewis, got two optimals. We'll go ahead and uh, actually bring it down and see if that'll stay. We'll, we'll, either, we'll either have too much traction or not enough straight line. I know Lewis likes the car to turn, so we'll go ahead and bump that thing up. Ooh, I am nervous. I am nervous, nervous, nervous. I've never been this nervous for an F1 man. I've never had a title race go down to the last line where it wasn't my two drivers, so. Q1, let's see what happens. Mm. We did not make it better. So 5-0. And we did make it better for Lewis, so we'll go 6-0. Six, six, oh. Just make sure all the fuel is out of it. Yep, 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 yep. Please, Lewis, get to Q3-3. Whew, both drivers made it. Okay, I was worried after <laughs> I was real worried. All right, both drivers into Q3. We, uh, we made steps forward. Actually, no, we have. So we found our baseline with Fernando at 5-5. Five, five. Found our baseline with Lewis at 5-5. Five, five. I mean, this is for this is for all the marbles. This is what uh, this is what you hope that your season comes down to. I said so we have the uh, the luxury of already having wrapped up the uh, the constructors championship, but I want I want to get Lewis that drivers championship. So, bon voyage. Let's see if we can uh, if we can out qualify the uh, the bulls. Would you check? I think it's okay. That's green now. I'm genuinely nervous. I'm I'm amazed that I have genuine nerves right now, as Fernando is going faster than Lewis at the moment. Don't get impeded. Don't get impeded. Move. Move. Fuck. Just bankers. Just bankers. Just bankers. And Verstappen sets the tone. God, he's so fucking good. <laughs> I mean, car setup. I don't know why. Okay, so I guess it didn't save the setup for whatever reason. So I guess they weren't at full confidence anyways. So that's, I guess, a blessing in disguise, I suppose. I mean, that is that is a hell of a lap. I know he's got grid penalties for components and whatnot, but that is a hell of a lap. Nobody wants to. <laughs> everybody's waiting. Nobody wants to be the last one out on track, or nobody wants to be the first one out on track. Okay, we'll send Fernando out. It's not that. Uh, it's not that important. And Lewis will be the last one to uh, to set a timed lap. All right, this is for all the marbles. I think we're gonna go ahead and sit, uh, take one last ride here with Mr. Hamilton. Let's hope it's good enough for uh, to at least be close to Verstappen.
All right, we'll go ahead and check in with him after the fact. So next across the line will be the Alpine of Pierre Gasly coming off that win in Brazil. Wants to end the season on a high. He is currently P4. He will stay P4. Next comes the Mercedes of George Russell. He stays P7. Norris across the line stays P6. Fernando across the line. He jumps up to P5, thankfully. Everybody else across the line. We'll see what Lewis can do. Hopefully he can get close. All I want is a shot. Only P6. Wow. Oh, boy. Thankfully, Verstappen and Leclerc do have penalties, although I don't know if it'll be from the back or if it'll be component or whatnot. Um, we've got a pretty tough race on our hands. Um, Drivers are strapping themselves in, ready for race day. We are in, I, I am genuinely kind of stressed out. I, I can't lie. I know these races are usually, there's always usually a safety car thrown in there somewhere. Um, 27, 31, 27, 29, 27, 22 on the two stop. I think with Fernando, we'll go for it. Obviously he's got nothing to lose. This is his, uh, his last ride with us. Hopefully we can uh, send it out on a high. Um, So yeah, we'll do that for Fernando. It's the fastest one on paper. We'll see if it is in actuality. Uh, meanwhile, with Lewis, no, I want to. I want to try to run with them. We're gonna go medium hard. If we get burnt by the safety car, so be it. It's already gonna be a tough race as is. Worst case, we can always just convert to the two stop. Man, I am. I am genuinely nervous. We'll see where Verstappen's starting. I know we're third and fourth, so we are. We are starting ahead of them. We're starting ahead of them. This is what we're doing. Okay. Well, place your bets now, folks. This is um, this is going to go down to the wire. I um, I have not been this nervous. This has been a full season of tough moments, of surprise moments, of highs and lows. And it's all going to come down to one race for the Drivers' Championship. F1 wishes that they could have this uh, this interesting. It's a rematch of uh, of the famed 2021 season. Hamilton versus Verstappen. Let's see who comes out on top, and let's see if I fuck this up. <laughs> the drivers are lined up tonight under mostly clear skies. Looking here at Fernando Alonso. Starting in third place, they're in a really good position for this race. And looking at the second Williams car. They're in the front half of the pack, so there's plenty of potential for them. Will their hard work pay off today? Hold on tight. It's the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. And it's lights out, and away we go. Lights out, and away we go indeed. Hamilton did not get off to the greatest of starts, I will admit. Gonna need to use that battery to re-overtake and actually now defend. To use the overtake. Nope, overtake now. Overtake now. Overtake now. Shit, I should have just left it on defend. Oh well. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. Not the end of the world. Verstappen is that was Verstappen. <laughs> so obviously it was a small component fix. Um Fernando, defend for your life. Luis is gonna come back at Verstappen here, not gonna let him get away. So Verstappen has elected to start on the medium compound of tire. Understood. Really need the the goal here is to uh, to really hold up Verstappen, but I don't even know because we need to we need to win the race and just hope Verstappen doesn't have uh, the race that he wants. Looks like everybody seems to have gotten away pretty well. Um, more or less same strategy throughout the field, medium or soft. Lewis is the one oddball in the crazy strat, but obviously we might just. Switch that to a uh, medium, medium to finish, two stop. And he is just not, he's just not giving up. And at the same time, the best thing that Verstappen could do is, uh, is just prevent Lewis from going any farther forward. You know what? We're going to do that. We're going to switch him to a two stop, medium, medium.
I have a gut, I just have a really weird gut feeling. I don't want to get burned on the one stop. Especially not with the high likelihood of a safety car. Always you gotta, always you gotta do is just keep it with. We'll have DRS. We'll have DRS, so he needs to deploy, make sure he just, oh god. He did not stay in DRS range, did he? He did not. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Ferrari, not a big deal. Race position. Got passed by a Ferrari on softs. Not the end of the world. Renault's in the lead? What the? Fast Tesla. <laughs> okay. That's cool. Didn't see that happening. Obviously, Fernando going purple there. Uh, big stack up. Paris has gotten past Alonso. Verstappen's still fighting with Gasly. We've actually opened up the gap Red behind. We have up. lost a ton of time. I don't know what the hell just happened there. But we also have Check no battery. Paris. It is race critical that Lewis gets back inside the DRS, and unfortunately, he has not got it. He does have it Lewis now. Thankfully, we were able to get it back. It's the he perk of being on those back. hards. You just got to survive, and then uh, then they come really, really valuable as the uh, the Red Bull onslaught continues. I'm going to quickly deploy here and go aggressive sure on the tires, make sure they do not run away. Okay, copy. Because at the end of the day, I also, I'd love to win this race with Fernando, Lewis get second, and then Get Verstappen fall out. Okay, copy. Or just something. My well, Lewis is out of battery again. I think he'll miss out on DRS again. That's unfortunate. We are out of battery. Unfortunately, just going to have to concede this for the time being. Not really much we can do. Bathas behind isn't slow, so hopefully we'll be able to jump on. But the Red Bulls have uh, have blitzed us, and we might just fall out of DRS range of them. I think we have. Oh no, we haven't. Pushing on, pushing on. It's the great thing when they okay. run out of battery and you have battery, you just immediately rocket back up to them. But yeah, that's, that is really unfortunate okay, for Lewis's copy. race, but still a long way to go. Obviously, the idea here is that there's usually a uh, three one three wide isn't going to help our lap time. Uh, Sonoda's had a lockup going into the end of the back straight away. Okay, that's good. Um, that's good. And there's an overtake from Williams. Just need to stick with them. Oh, all this, all this race is right now is just maintaining the gap, not losing too much time, and uh, just sticking with them. You can those, those hards are going to start first. coming in here in about a lap. Ooh. There we go. These uh, these hards should start coming in about a lap or two, where they where they start to actually be an advantage over the medium compound tires. So, desperately waiting for that. <laughs> um, as this is a marathon. I mean, I'm I'm convinced that at some point um, there will be a safety car this race. Always there always is. Never fails. Uh, sometimes there's one. Sometimes I've I've had five. I've had five to end the season um, before. So. Got to be ready for anything. Let's reduce lifting coast by one level. So it looks like Gasly's falling off the back of the, the front trio here of uh, of Alonso, Verstappen, and Perez. Let's you know, lifting coast. I guess theoretically, I should I should be going for the win with with Hamilton and not trying to play the the impede role. But um, I don't know. I'm not I'm not too worried at the moment. But uh, I'd be lying if I said I wasn't stressing out a little bit. I'm going to quickly pause it here and look into the pit lane and preferably the look back. So the Mercedes garage is preparing for one of their drivers to come in, but not Red Bull. At least I don't think so. I think we're just going to do whatever Verstappen does. That's going to be the uh, the goal here, the main play. Question is, it's going to be a really late decision if he, if they do decide to come in. Not this lap, at least not with the. Uh... Oh, Perez is coming in. No? Okay, never mind. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So we'll. Okay, so that must have been the soft compound people that or the people that started on the soft compound that had, had come into the pit lane. Okay, we'll see. Uh, we'll see what happens here. 
it's a race position gained for Mercedes. Is Red Bull coming into the pit lane this time? I believe that is Verstappen about to dart into the pit lane. Nope. Not quite. Come on. And it's got to be one of these laps. We'll stick to our guns. We'll come in this lap, take on our hard tires, and commit. Box, box. Why does okay, that sound box. so erotic? Box, box. That Hamilton like saving some nice battery right, right there. there. Would be nice if, if you could, like, you know, see who on the pit lane has their crew out, like, or you could pull a bluff. I don't know. There's so much more that could have been done with this game. It's a shame that they that they you know pulled the plug so early. Um, obviously, I get it, but at the same time, ugh, grr. So Alonzo will be in this lap. Looks like the Red Bulls have stayed out too late to cancel the pit stop. We are committed now. We are committed. Looks like Alpine will be following us into the pit lane. Esteban Alcon. We'll see where Fernando comes out. Should be Roger. interesting. Crucially coming out ahead of the train, but unfortunately at the same time, not exactly in the greatest position to uh, to make time. Ah. Go, Fernando. Go. Increase lifting coast. When is Red Bull going to pull the plug? Come on. I mean, Fernando is doing some serious laps right now. Ah, Lewis, come on, man. Can you not lose DRS? For five bloody minutes. Well, Red Bull stays out again. So 17 seconds. As Fernando Alonso definitely sets the fastest lap this time. Gonna go ahead and bring Lewis in this lap for a set of mediums. I believe a lot of the guys okay, will actually be good. in as Left well. Left time out good. Left time out good. I fire in fuego. Nico, increase, please. Yep. Surely one of them will be in this lap. One of them. It will be Verstappen that is in this lap. Okay. Hmm. So we'll go ahead and drop this down for now. He should come out in the lead. Um. Oh, we just lost quite a bit of time from that, actually. That was kind of annoying. Um, so Verstappen in the pit lane. Didn't get impeded. Fernando should come out in the lead. And of course, we got held up. Because why wouldn't we? All right, time to play the Perez role. So Verstappen behind is on a set of hards. I'd imagine he's going to be going to the end. Hmm. Actually, I should wait to deploy that. Let's go neutral here. There's a yellow flag in sector three, not a safety car though. Sounds Gonna try to take like fast lap here with uh, with Lou. Lulu. DRS. Copy.
Yeah, we're not impeding them intentionally. We're just trying to make these uh, these tires last. Sure, go ahead, pass me. So go ahead and pass me focus. before the DRS zone. Copy. It's a stomping lap. Here comes Perez. You go push. Okay. Red Bull gained the place. Look at me actually, actually throwing. <laughs> DRS is currently disabled. DRS is currently disabled. The best Stop it. Plan. And a new position just gained by Williams. Oh, you think you can pass me? No. You think in real life Fernando would ever like make himself look kind of, kind of like a fool to help Lewis Hamilton win a championship? <laughs> I think not. Actually, we're going to go ahead and save it here and we'll get him on the next straight away. Oh, okay. Or Verstappen's got the same idea. Keep doing what you're doing. Increase lift and coast. Although, you know, if there was somebody that you'd want as a great teammate that knew how to defend, I think Fernando would be that guy. And there's an overtake from Williams. You want to do it? Again? Want to see me do it again? Yeah, I, I don't have that pace. Keep your head down. Keep pushing. Keep pushing. For stopping his DRS, it's over. <laughs> yes. Some proper micromanaging. What are you gonna learn? Keep the head down. Oh shit. Caught me sleeping. Red Bull moved up. Use the rest. Yeah, copy. Wow, did he just break the RS? Oh my god. Wow, we're fucked. Oh, I was so close. I was like a couple laps away. Oh god damn. Back off. Copy. God damn. That is what you call getting outplayed. Alpine just advanced. Bro, he's already so far gone. <laughs> Ferrari, advance the race position. Oh shit. No flag sector one. Not a safety car. We've just had a crash on the track. Ooh, Alcon, that's tough. Needless to say, this has been a bit of a strange race. I'm not used to having to throw so hard. <laughs>
Mercedes moved up a place. I feel like if we could have kept it behind for me one, one or two more laps, we could have gotten away with it. I mean, they, I mean, in the end, I just, I cut, I cut development on this car way too soon. Sort of focus. I mean, we're gonna have a kick-ass car next year. Um, it's just unfortunate that, you know, I, I just, I, I stopped. You know, we got that floor upgrade. We were the ninth uh, fastest car, like out of the twenty, we were the ninth fastest car in low speed, and then seventh and seventh in medium and high speed. So, we had a, we had a really good piece. Um. God, I really hope that safety car comes now. And a new position Please. just gained by Please. Williams. Oh, and Ferrari just gained a place. Bit windows yeah, open, box. come get served. So this lap? Yes, Lewis, this lap. Should I just send Fernando Long? <laughs> Try to impede uh, Verstappen? Oh my god, he's already caught back up to Perez. That is disgusting. Great timing. Probably what might what might just be the last pit stop of the season. Right uh, right there. And there's an overtake from Williams. That's a good overtake from Alpine. Really, like I said, at this point, I'm just kind of hoping for a safety car. So lifting coast level three. Yeah, this is not, not going to be enough. I mean, we still have the constructors in hand, thankfully. Um, yeah. So we need seven points, seven, uh, seven smackarooskies, and uh, we don't got that at the moment. I keep seeing these yellow flags pop up, and I get really excited, and it's like, we just had a car run wide. We want to leave court, please. Copy. I mean, they're making up time on Bottas and Leclerc, but the problem is Red Bull's 13 seconds clear. <laughs> so, uh, P3 doesn't really do a whole lot of good at the moment. Really need... Uh, th this. If there's no safety car, this will be the first Alpine finale race that I've ever done that has not had a safety car. As uh, we've gotten uh, to the back of Valtteri Bottas. Gonna go ahead and go to Harvest here, make sure that we do not Switch pass him before the, uh, the main DRS zone. Level. Then uh, we'll go ahead and overtake them here. Let's reduce lifting coast. Go, go neutral. I mean, we can definitely get to the podium, but it's like it would need to happen this lap. It would need to be this lap. I mean, it's gonna be sad if, if he does get P3 here. Um, just kind of a slap in the face, really. Yeah, it's already too late for a safety car. Wanna save a little bit of battery here for the last lap. I don't necessarily mind dropping back a spot or two. Uh, we're gonna pit Fernando here on this last lap, try to go for a fast lap. We have a pretty decent set of softs waiting for us, so. Go ahead and take advantage of that. Box, box. Okay, box. What are the odds? Just that's two laps to go. Perez just rams into. No. <gasps> oh, there's the safety car.
Oh. Okay, it's a safety car. Safety car right at the end. Positive on the Delta. There's been a crash. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Has this was the Aston Wadded Bucks. into a barrier. And what will more than likely be his last season in F1 for at least the foreseeable future. Oh. And that. I am, uh, I'm gutted. I'm well and truly gutted. Make sure we get both cars home. Well, needed that safety car about five laps ago, and uh, just didn't uh, just didn't materialize. So uh, yeah, that's gonna be our season right there. We've uh, we've won the constructors. That's a that's a big that's a big one for us. Um, But this is the final lap. Nine and fourteen is better than seven and twelve. That's the uh, that's the gist of it, at least. knew we uh, knew we needed to capitalize there in Brazil. Um, you know, when when your main competition spins out, you really need to to put it all together. It's just unfortunate that we got, got held up in the pits there. And uh, yeah, it's gonna cost. It's gonna cost Lewis at least a shot. I don't. I don't know. I mean, Michael Massey, are you there? <laughs> oh well. So with that, Fernando Alonso will finish P3 in his final race for us. I, I wish we could have gone for fast lap there, but uh, just unfortunate timing. Bottas holds on to uh, to P4, um, even with Perez scoring max points. Actually, Valtteri needed to, to score decent enough, and looks like he's done so. Uh, Russell holds on to P6. Pierre Gasly will take home P7 in the championship list. The lead Alpine driver got his uh, got his one win last week. Finished on a high, I suppose. He's going to finish fourth here. Uh, the two Ferraris. Science has actually come all the way back from being, I believe, almost 60 points down on his teammate to uh, to take over the uh, the actually took over it last week um, to finish eighth and ninth. Norris stays P10. Alcon P11. You can kind of I'll kind of go through the rest of the field. I don't think any positions really changed. Um, well, uh, definitely an anticlimactic end of the season. I was hoping for a bit more. Um, in terms of constructors, obviously we win. Mercedes holds off the late charge by Ferrari to be a P3. McLaren holds on to be P9 or P6 over Alfa Romeo. Aston Martin will receive nothing. So, in the end, congratulations to Max Verstappen and Red Bull. They. Uh, Actually, Sergio Perez right wins the race, so they get the uh, they get the fairy tale send off. Both sides of the garage are happy. That will uh, that will end the race and that will end our season. That is uh, definitely an unfortunate way to to end it all. Would have loved to have gone for the uh, for the That's fast the lap there with Fernando, but. Thank you so much for continuing to push this year. I'm so inspired by you guys. Yeah, copy. Nice job. Nice and job. and for us, we don't really know. Lewis is inside for next year, and Fernando's already already announced that he's going Chicken elsewhere. Flag. Flag. It's uh, it's going to be a fun off season. Yeah, well done again. Good but, strategy. Um, Good to start. Props to Fernando for being a team player there. That's uh, solid. As uh, Guan Yu Zhou will take uh, will take home the last point of the season. It is Alpha Tauri. What a way to end it. What a freaking way to end it. <sighs> I'm actually sad. I'm genuinely sad. Um, you know, I thought for a second there that maybe if we had held on with Fernando um, for, you know, two or three more laps, maybe we could have made uh, a run up for Stappen. But uh, he got by it, and then I just disappeared. He just great driver with a great car. Just took off, and there really wasn't anything we can do. So, with that, doesn't take away from our season. I mean, I mean, like look at that nine in, in 22 races, nine wins, 13 podiums, 12 fastest laps. Got a little little cheeky pole position. I don't think we ever really were the fastest car. Maybe maybe for round one we were the fastest car, but. Um, 
Just uh, didn't quite have it. Didn't quite have it. Should have should have maybe invested a bit more into the car instead of focusing on next year. That one's definitely going to be uh, going to be big for us. And uh, I hope I'll uh, I hope I'll see you guys there. Take care.